Damn it! Wow. Welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I'm here with Geeky Sparkles. Hello. And, and damn it! They canceled Daredevil. They yeah. canceled Daredevil. Now remember, Mama Sparkle sometimes watches this. <laughs> yeah, we watch the show together. Uh, Geeky. No, no, no. I meant my mom watches the show, and you're like, damn it, damn it. Anyway, go ahead. Well, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I didn't. I didn't say anything worse than that. No, I'm pissed. I'm. I'm yeah, thoroughly pissed off. I'm not off. very happy about this one either. I thought it was a joke. I, I saw it on uh, Twitter just a couple of minutes ago that they pulled the plug on Daredevil. Netflix has canceled Daredevil. Uh, and that was their their top performing Marvel show. It was Daredevil was the the, the one I liked the best. They had uh, they had teased uh, uh, you know they had a lot of cliffhangers set up. They teased a season four. Uh, they teased a, 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 a plot line with Bullseye. Um, I think they kind of wrapped a lot of that up though in the last one. I mean, it could end there and it would have been fine. So the series ends with Bullseye. Spoiler: the series ends with Bullseye opening his eyes. In like schlock movie fashion, that's how Daredevil goes out. He didn't even get to wear the damn suit again by the end of season three. Well, that was his choice, though, I think. I know, but just what I'm saying is there was a lot more story to tell, and this is uh, infuriating. This is... Yeah, I'm not very high about this one either. Um, I really like Daredevil. <laughs> so I, I did. I like yeah, that We just got done it. watching season three a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Now, it just came out not that lot, being in November, wasn't it? Yeah. And of all the shows... Uh, now, they have canceled you know some of the other Netflix MCU shows. Of all the shows... Uh, that they were going to cancel. I thought for sure at least Daredevil would be the last one standing right. because the ratings were so good for it. It is easily the most popular. And um, they pulled the plug on it. They pulled the plug on Daredevil. I'm just like, holy shit, guys. You guys were getting really good. Well, I think this has more to do with the fact that because they're trying to take everything off of Netflix and that because Disney wants to do its own thing. Oh, I have no doubt. I have no doubt that the root of all of this is Disney's streaming service. Mm -hmm. They're going to do their own shows based on the MCU next year with uh, Avengers characters. Uh, I have no doubt. And I think, though, you know, I think these... I think this was a mistake. You should have brought Daredevil in that. I mean, they probably couldn't. It probably because they had the deal with Netflix. They're co-owned. I think they're co-owned. Yeah, they by couldn't Netflix. do it. I mean, that's probably why they did it. It's better to cancel them than you know give Netflix a biscuit because they're trying to be their competition. Well, yeah, and that's exactly what's going on but here. Then who suffers? Uh, the fans suffer. Yeah, right? and uh, you actually, know, I like Daredevil quite a bit. I did, and you know, honestly, there would. I mean, honestly, uh, you know, Disney, you should have just paid the money to Netflix to buy them out uh, to get these characters back. People would have absolutely watched. Uh, you know, Daredevil and, and Jessica Jones and Punisher on I, I had to watch their Punisher season. I didn't see it. Jessica Jones, she's it's okay. I mean, uh, you haven't watched it. I've watched both seasons. I actually haven't watched Jessica Jones, um, no. It's okay. I just, I'm not into Jessica Jones like I like the other characters. Even though she's a woman, I should be. Well, now, I'm just not. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. I mean, I watched her in Defenders. I actually didn't watch Jessica Jones. Uh, watch Daredevil. I uh, muscled my way through Iron Fist, which was a, a portion well, of my life. Well, we didn't watch the rest of it. I was not season day. two, but the first season, uh, and uh, that's... i got to watch the rest of that. Well, too. now that I know it's canceled, I really don't care. You know? really? <laughs> it's like, I really don't well, care. I'm like, I'm. I, it was already boring, but I thought maybe they would do another Defenders, and I wanted to keep up with what was going on. I did like the Defenders. I, don't care. I did like the Defenders. Jessica Jones, um, I like her no bullshit tolerance, or no bullshit, you know, she has no little bullshit tolerance, you know, doesn't take crap. I like that, but I, I just don't like, I just don't get into Jessica Jones. Yeah. Um, anyway. Well, Jessica Jones and Punisher are getting uh, new seasons now. The thing is, both of those are being produced right now. So That's I think it was, why. it was too late to pull the plug. But yeah, this, this whole thing is, I guarantee you, they're not saying as much, but I guarantee you it's because of Disney's streaming service. Uh, they're well, just pulling the plug. I would guarantee on it, but. I, I'm, I'm. 99 um, uh, sure. yeah i'm pretty sure i wouldn't say i guarantee it what do you get if you're wrong what, what's their guarantee they I get i get a no prize i get i get no daredevil i get no damn daredevil season four <laughs> and i'm guaranteed. pissed i'm so That's pissed but okay okay daredevil canceled no season four at netflix coming from ign netflix and marvel say goodbye to daredevil they say goodbye to the fans with a big middle finger uh, waving it in their faces. They kind of wrapped it up. No, they kind I of mean, wrapped it I'm up. I'm mad but... about it too, but man, you're like... No, I was just thinking the other day how much I couldn't wait for Daredevil Season 4 and how long it's been since I've been that excited about a TV show. I thought Season 3 was fantastic. It was really good. Uh, you know, Season 2 was kind of eh, but Season 3 was great. I was looking forward to another season, yeah, and, and this is how they proud. freaking end We it. are tremendously proud of the show's last and final season, and although it's painful for the fans, we feel it's best to close the chapter to high note. No, it's because probably because, you know, you yeah. want to 
take it, things away from Netflix. But okay. Yeah, we're, we're thankful to showrunner Eric Olson, the, the show's writers, stellar crew, and incredible cast, including Charlie Cox as Daredevil himself. A very nice guy, by the way. He was at uh, Wizard World Pittsburgh. Um, and we're grateful to fans who have supported the show over the years. While the series on Netflix has ended, the three existing seasons will remain on the service yeah, for years to come. Uh, while the Daredevil character will live on in future projects for Marvel. Well, there you go. Yeah, but will it be the same Daredevil? Because no, it, it's, but I don't know. The Daredevil character will live on. What they need to do is is keep uh, Charlie Cox and bring Daredevil into like the Avengers or something. You know, um, I don't know. Yeah. I don't I mean, know. It's not like he hasn't done movies before. Come on. I don't think that. I don't think that they're going to do that. I, I have to wonder because, you know, even though they sort of had uh, some connection to the MCU with Daredevil, they mentioned they they sort of uh, mentioned the uh, you know attack on New York yeah. in the first season. It's never really brought up again. So I think that it's sort of like in its own little pocket universe. So they probably if they bring Daredevil into the MCU proper. I got to think they're probably just going to reboot the character. I know. Too. They probably I don't are. See I don't think that's a good idea. I don't want to see um, that. Damn. So they basically are, they're not saying there won't be more Daredevil. And they're not saying it won't be him, but you know. There's not going to be another show on Netflix. I think honestly, though, it's probably co-created uh, with Netflix or there's some joint custody thing going on. So I have to think that that version of it's Daredevil custody. is. custody. It's like mom and dad. Uh, mom and dad are fighting. Kids. So I think that this version of Daredevil's gone i think this is it this is it for uh the charlie cox version of daredevil Sucks um, he was good he was he was perfect uh and and uh you know uh, wilson fisk uh d'onofrio was was amazing i can't imagine uh somebody else playing that role in the mcu i don't want to see somebody else play that role um daredevil is the third marvel netflix collaboration to be canceled leaving punisher and jessica jones as the last remaining series on the streaming provider both have new seasons on the horizon punisher returns in early 2019 and jessica jones is currently in production probably because it's too late to pull the plug right. uh, but considering daredevil was netflix's flagship marvel series the fate of both punisher and jessica jones look grim yeah i don't think we're gonna get any more uh, of either one uh we wouldn't place your bets on either show getting renewed yeah I just said that. Yeah, Iron well. Fist was the first to fall because everybody's like, well, Iron Fist is meh, you know, whatever, not a big deal. Um, but yeah, this is, this is, uh, this sucks. You know, yeah, here they okay. mentioned, they mentioned uh, Disney Plus. They said that the cancellations come as Disney is gearing up to launch its own competitive streaming service, Disney Plus. The service will offer its own Marvel series, including one featuring Tom Hiddleston's yeah. Loki, um, which is fine. But, you know, I, I like the fact that these sort of like C-list Marvel characters get to live on in in TV. You know, yeah. I would. I mean, you know, this is great that they're doing more with the Avengers, but the Avengers already have a movie series. They've already got right, you know right. all this going on. So, but they're um, not saying they won't do it with Daredevil. They're not saying they won't use him. But I think it's if they pretty were smart, much. They would, but they probably you know. I mean, they were smart. They would, but they'd have to redo it because it, it, it can't be the one with Netflix. Right. Right. Um. But all right. So um. Final thoughts. I'm I'm hugely pissed off. Yeah, no kidding. Um, you I'm, guys thought I was bad. Well, no, I don't watch much television. I don't watch much television. He doesn't have time, but this is one. I day. don't have much time to watch TV. Daredevil is one show I've watched every episode of. I've watched every episode of Defenders. Uh, I'm very lucky if I get time to watch movies. I'm very, very busy, and I always make time for Daredevil, and they freaking pulled the rug out from underneath me, and I'm pissed. Well, I kind of figured they were going to do this with they're canceling everything else and the plus the Disney Plus. I yeah. honestly am not surprised at all. I'm sad. <sighs> but I'm, I'm not sad. Surprised. I'm not surprised either. I guess I kind of wondered how long it was going to take them to do it. But then when they said they were going to do another Punisher, I'm like, well, Daredevil's good because they they had you know a couple of cliffhangers at the end of last season, mm -hmm. and uh, you know Daredevils are top rate. I mean, if anything uh, is left standing, it'll be Daredevil because it was the top Marvel show on Netflix, but. Damn it. See, they had some cliffhangers, but they mostly, to me, it seemed like they tied a lot of it up. No, there's more story. I just, I'm they just saying. They need more and story. I did, catch, I did catch that. And I remember thinking to myself, well, that's an awful lot of, I mean, yeah, I could go on, but that's very tidy. The only upside to this is if they would bring Daredevil into the MCU proper into the movies, maybe we would finally get a Daredevil and Spider-Man team up. Uh, on on film on the big screen, I, I guess that's kind of a consolation. But more, if more Charlie Cox, less Ben Affleck. <laughs> yeah, more Charlie Cox, less Ben Affleck. I'm worried they're gonna recast Daredevil as as uh, someone who's just frankly not as good. Um, he was perfect. It was good. It was such a damn good. Well, see, show. I was already partial. Uh, Stardust is my favorite movies ever, so I was already yeah. like, yes, you know. But yeah, he's a he's a nice guy too. He's a real nice guy. Um, pissed, pissed, pissed off. Okay. 
Uh, final thoughts? I, I'm I'm a, I'm bummed. I mean, I really liked it quite a bit, and it one time you actually would stop working and do something with me. Uh, besides, oh videos. thanks. Um, <laughs> besides videos. Well, no, we do. Yeah, I just don't have a lot of time. I, um, I work a day job on top of doing this stuff, and I it just is don't have sad because it was really it was a good show. Um, I'm not surprised though. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Um, I do feel your pain. I totally, you know, trust me. Anybody gets your pain? It's me. I get I it. You get it. Um, you know, and, and there was lots of you know brushable hair in the show. There was. There was a lot so. of brushable hair. Yeah. Um, except for except for uh, Kingpin, he didn't have any brushable he, he hair. He needed it. He needed a. If he, uh, he had needed a fro. It, he would have been happier. If Kingpin had a fro, if he had brushable hair, the show would still be on. No, he would have been happier in life. He would have been happier. He wouldn't have uh, uh, punched as many guys in the face, uh, yeah. pummeled them because he would he had just his brushed hair, hair instead. He brushes hair to relieve his stress. I'm actually of playing with mine right now. Smashing is people anyway. in the face. Um, okay, so we're gonna wrap this one up. Subscribe to Clownfish TV for more pop culture news, views, and rants, art videos, gaming videos, and more. And uh, no more Daredevil videos because it's done. It's freaking over. <laughs> Gone. It's dead. It's dead to me. It's oh, dead God. to me. You are dead to me, Daredevil. Why is he dead to you? It's not his fault. Because Netflix killed him. So Netflix would be dead to you, not Daredevil. No, I still like Netflix because they've got some good shows. Some. So. <laughs> yeah, some. Okay. Others, others not so much. Others not, not so much. Names. Others not so not much. Not name names. But anyway. Okay, so we're going to wrap this one up. Okay. We'll see you later. All right. Goodbye. Bye.